can't get her in. Hold on. Oh my god! Oh my god. Mulch that there was a root under the mulch, so yeah. I had it stable. I thought I got up on the very top. I was doing this, and the, and, the, huh. and the leg slipped off the root, and the ladder went. Whew. No lie, dude. And I had a hold of the lights, and there were tent. It was taunt on the yeah. other one. Yeah. And my feet went out, and I think between the tauntness. Yeah. And the mulch, I just went down with the line like a rope. Yeah. And land on my back, jumped up, and people were walking around setting up stuff. I said like, no one saw me. I was like, yeah. Like, <laughs> Put it back up there and like reset it, climb back up there, did my job. That's like some Clark I was like, you guys fell 12 feet straight on my back. <laughs> what is going on, you guys? I'm out here with my favorite crew. We got Ben Morris with Salty Waters OBX, one of the best guys in the Outer Banks. Y'all need to check him out. And, and Virginia. Got that's my where hubby we today, here. people. Y'all, right. we are cruising out of the Virginia Beach Ocean front. Today, we're just going after everything from cobia to mahi, and then hopefully, going to get on some. Who the heck knows? Flounder, flounder on some reds. Flounder, rest. mahi. <laughs> We're gonna go check out some wrecks. Ben's got a day off. We're just fun fishing today. Yep. So you guys, if y'all haven't seen Ben on the channel, Salty Waters OBX. Ben, what are you thinking today? I'm thinking we'll uh, hopefully go into these cans, get some brownfish first. Yes. And then maybe move out to these, the tower or the windmills and get on some mahi. It's kind of program and then hit some flounder spots. We also brought spear fishing gear. Heck we brought yeah. Y'all, we're gonna just see what we can get on today, but starting with some cans and buoys, we got bucktails tied on. Ready to go to get on big old brown fish. So we're gonna start out right out here. It is slick, calm today, low winds. And I got two awesome guys with me today. You guys, today's perfect. We have a light east wind. It's been honking southwest for the past like week with the hurricane and everything. So the water got all murked up. We've also had a really bad red tide. But for the past two or three days, we've had a light east wind. So the water is significantly clearer right here, but that's gonna help us out, hopefully, when we get way out to these cans. And hopefully that's gonna push some of these mahi, even like some king mackerel. Who the heck knows what we're gonna catch today? Right. I'm just joked. There's we... always an adventure on the ocean, always. Uh, yeah, Monday fun day people going down right now. That's let's right. hit it. All right, let's <laughs> hit it. All right, y'all, so here it is. This is the first can that we're coming to. So these cobia will literally be swimming right around these cans. They'll also be all up and down the chains. Nice cast. All right, let's see what's behind door number two. We'll go right back to that can trope right now. All right, y'all. So like the third can we came up on, there's a pretty decent sized cobia swimming right around it. Through the bucktail. No, nah, just wait for Ben, because the eel is less, it's not going to spook them. Sometimes you keep throwing the bucktail, they'll get a little shy. You saw him come up though, Ben? Oh yeah, big time. Yeah, he came like right up the tunnel. There you go. Alright, Christy, take it. You're good, you're good. Go, go, go. You're good. Let me get out of here. Nice job. Nice. There you go. Or this is just like tuna fishing on the oil rigs in Louisiana. You got to get on the gas and crank them off the can. All right, Christy. Nice he does not want to fight. He's going to yeah, freak cool. out. <laughs> that other one was much bigger. That's that was great. He's going to go back and pick off another one. Get you guys. Oscar 5000. It's getting it done. You'll still love. Perfect. We'll probably go right back there to that can, you guys, and pick off his friend. That's how you guys get it done. <laughs> not a very big one, but not bad for the first one of the day. All right, we're gonna send her back. Go back and get big, buddy. Number dos on the eel. Eel for the win. Whoa, he's he still green. Hello. Oh, he's like, not right now. <laughs> Flipped him right in. Nice work. He looks a little bigger. Yeah. All right, you guys. Cobia number two, and we're batting a thousand today. Every cobia we've seen, we hooked up on on the eel. Well, actually, we did lose one, or didn't? We didn't hook up to the nice one. But we're getting bigger, and we only want to harvest the cobia that we know we want to eat, so the bigger one. So this guy's like almost right at keeper size. To the yeah. 
And the eel's still alive. Nice. Another Finn on making Osprey. it happen. Ew. Osprey, the get it done, y'all. Nice. Boom. Let's get, us get it done. Let's get this guy. <laughs> and the camera soaked. <laughs> Alright y'all, so right now there's tons of spade fish swirling around the boat right now. So I'm gonna I'm gonna uh strap on my mask and get my uh spear gun and I'm gonna pop one. <laughs> Could be more yeah. of them. It smoked that lure. Was that a nice one? No, yeah. It got real tight, real fast, and then all of a sudden we lost it. I, oh, I'm getting whacked. I just go. I'm on. You on? I'm on. Okay. Hold on. Ah, dang it. He's fought, he, He's back on it. He's on. He's on. I got him. You got him? Yep, I got him. Yeah. We got him. Get that net ready. Get that net. He's a good, decent one. Yeah. They come down. All right, people. He's right here. Dang it. All right, bro. You're good. You're good. All right, y'all. We hooked up. Pulled a uh, nice Kobe off the can. Nice. About time, babe. Oh, he popped. Just kidding. <laughs> He's going to be right at 40 or short. All right, people. Woo. There it is. Just pulled this fun size cobia off of these cans. You guys, this is such a blast just out here. Dude, this is awesome. A lot of fun. Ben Morris, Salty Waters OBX, putting us on these beautiful Virginia cobia. Dang, that is awesome. Right it there. is. Let's see if we can't blast. get a big one off of there. Let's get another one. Yes, All right, it. here we go. See you later, dude. Watch. Oh shoot, I go. wasn't filming. Really? JK, <laughs> got yeah. you. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's a giant on this can. Christy, just wait for Ben. No, no, we're gonna play this one. We got plenty of time. It's 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 just chilling there. The left side. There she is. Yep. Yeah, there she is. There she is again. Left side. Which way? I'm past it, Ben. Which way's the face? Hold on. Let me just get in and spear it, dude. Oh my gosh, Ben. You want to go there? Why? Why not, dude? Seriously. Right there. All right, y'all. So this giant cobia is not eating. So we're gonna have to force it to cooperate. I'm gonna jump in and see if I can spear it off of this can. Hey, Ben, put me out here further so when I jump in, I don't spook it. Because I can always keep my eye on the can. All right, should I go in? Go ahead, go in. What's he doing? Right ah. <laughs> My adrenaline is pumping right now. I don't know, what is he doing? Dang, babe! Got the cook.
cobia on the spear. Perfect shot. 80 dude. freaking yeah, pounds. I think a kill shot. Kill shot? Yeah. Whatever the bit. Dang, Jeff. I think it stuck her. We didn't win you. Nice. Take this right up real fast. Oh She's coming up. She's coming up. Get that gaff. The big one. Watch y'all stuff. Move that rod. We step on that thing, we get broken. He's like Jeff. Oh my gosh. Here, Ben, I'm gonna do this, you do that. Do not let her get loose. Do not let her get loose. <laughs> oh my gosh, son! Ben. I can't believe you freaking got this massive. Ben, this is surreal. Ben! <laughs> get that scopia in the boot. Are we hey, filming right watch now? Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Go, flip. Can't get her in, hold on. Oh my god! Did that just happen? Oh my gosh! Oh dude, what the way? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Dude, she was beside it, and I was like, dude. "What is Jeff doing?" I, I saw like, you look down. Yes, she came at you. Did she? No, she swam right beside me, <gasps> and I was shaking, dude. <laughs> oh <laughs> my gosh! Belly shot and everything. Dude. Oh my gosh! Send a picture to Aaron. Dead gone. Oh my god! Ben, we gotta I can't get a picture of holding this. this thing, okay? I can't believe this. Go get that hammer. Let's put her to sleep. All right. Ready to hold the head up? Yes. Son. Get up under there. We'll do a trayway shot. You guys, are you? Get the get our trayway in there. Kidding me? Look at this beast. Are you kidding me? Woo! A giant. Ben, this is surreal. It's surreal. I can't That's believe what I love what's about happening. It. I literally feel like you never I'm in know a what's going to happen out here. That's the beautiful thing about it. Every day is different. That's insane. it. Never gets old. I know. If it gets old to you, then you gotta do something different, dude. That's all I can oh say. Oh my gosh, we but came out here and you. So I remember you said you're like you're like we're out here for an adventure. We're out here you for You never adventure. know what's gonna happen. Yep. You guys, this is insane. I love that. I don't think I can even lift this fish up. This is insane. You gotta like hold her towards me. I can't. <laughs> That's all you got? You know, oh my gosh, you guys, that right there, that was absolutely just one of the most memorable things that has ever happened to me fishing. 100% Christy and I, that's going to go down in the one fish, two fish analogs right there. That's one of the most memorable things that's ever happened on this YouTube channel. You guys, that right there is the best way to wrap up with it. Yes, it is. Yeah, that was insane. She won't eat something. Just stick a spear in her. Heck yeah. If you get lucky enough, we did. That was Woo. awesome. Proud of you, babe. Look how there. big his mouth is. Wow, Look. you could stick your whole hand in there. Giant. Okay. First yeah. thing we're going to do is we're going to rinse. Can you even? Oh my gosh. He's got so much meat. This is the biggest fish you've ever filleted. Yeah. Get yourself some Dexter knives, people. Yeah. Nice and sharp. Cause you gonna need it to fillet something like this. You guys I absolutely love filleting these fish. Right. I know what Jeff's having for dinner. Sushi. Sushi. Poke bowls. Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. This is by far probably one of the bigger fish that we have filleted on our channel. We've definitely flayed a lot of cobia, but this is probably the biggest that we've speared. Oh, that's a big fish. <laughs> and that's a mouth. I think it's bigger than you. Let's imagine. It's definitely bigger than you. Is that so much? Oh, I'm trying the blood. That's the blood. <laughs> they don't eat them. But then they right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dinner, lunch, and then some. That's, yeah. a, big, that's a good one there. <laughs> but check it out. Big old piece of meat. All right, people. This is what you do right here. You gotta pass positivity and give the fish to a stranger, right? No, not a stranger. A friend. A friend. A new friend. What love? That's, That's right. right. What love? What? What? Hey, what? What? Let's see what you got. What'd you get? <laughs> you got some fish, right? Yeah, I got some love. Got him, baby boy. That's it. Got him. Boom. 
All right, brother. All good. Thank all you right, for man. the love. Absolutely. Right, now it. I got to drop them in there. Just spread the love. That's all I ask. Yeah, I do you know that. What I mean, good lookout. That's what it's all about. Uh, all right, man. Hey, man. Have a good night. How many sharks you see? Actually, today? we didn't see any sharks today. Oh, really? No sharks. All right, people. So here we are. We are back in the kitchen, and this right here is my favorite part, one of my favorite parts of Cobia fishing. And that is filleting. This fillet was so big that I actually had to cut it in half. So this right here, this is our Cobia meat. Look at that. Look how beautiful that this meat is. Cut straight down the middle. We're gonna split this. Split the fillet just right down the middle. And watch how easy this comes off the skin. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this meat is incredible. See that right there? That's the meat we don't want. That is the meat that we do want. That looks awesome. All right, people, there it is. Look at how beautiful this piece of cobia meat is. This right here, this is what we are going to be making into our pokey. Okay, so now we're gonna start our poke bowl. So we got our meat, we're gonna flay that up. Then we got our base. We're gonna start with our base, and I like to use sushi rice for my poke bowls, but seaweed or rice is typically gonna be your most popular base. There we go, so here's our poke, so this is our poke bowl coming together. Rice, we got our vegetables. All right, so let's get to the good stuff and let's start filleting up this beautiful piece of meat right here for some pokey and even just some sashimi. So when I'm doing this, just small cuts. And again, when you guys freeze your meat, check this out, when it comes off, this is the end piece, but look at this. This is just beautiful sushi meat right here that you can even like, here, check it out. Take some rice, this is sushi rice. Squeeze it in your hand. Put it over just like that. There you go. That's a little sushi roll right there. A little Cobia sushi roll. So good. So when y'all freeze your meat, just look at the texture of these fillets, how they're coming off. I'm really hungry right now. So, all right, so all we're doing, just put your meat right over top of everything else. Spread it out evenly. There it is, people. Oh my gosh. So I got some of this sauce, got it in my spoon, and just, I like to just dab it on here. Then, of course, everybody's favorite. Gotta have the soy sauce, for sure. All right, people, so, oh my gosh. Here it is. This is just like, this is actually my favorite thing to eat. Fun fact, is pokey. You guys, this is absolutely in Insane. First bite of our Cobia Poke Bowl. So good. So good. That is no fishiness to it at all. You guys, I hope that y'all enjoyed this video. Um, I really just cannot thank y'all enough for the opportunity to like share these fishing adventures and to just honestly like sh Christy and I just share our life with y'all. And uh, we really appreciate the support and we're just gonna keep it coming. Get up off your couch, get up off your butt, go catch yourself some fish. I'm gonna eat the rest of my poke bowl. And you guys, love to hear your feedback on this video, recipes, anything y'all want us to see, anything that y'all want us to do, and anything that y'all wanna see, definitely let us know in the comment section. And please subscribe, help us out if y'all haven't. Um, yeah, we just, yeah, anyways. That's all I got for today. Peace out.